Hello everybody, this is Elissa from Mink Arts and Crafts and today we are going to go ahead and open the moon box from Swartz Designs by Abigail Marie. I'm super excited to break into this and see what this looks like and see what all it is in here. So this is part of her bi-monthly subscription, her Swartz subscription box. So this is where you can sign up and you can get a box every other month and it's going to have a different three theme and for the month of January I almost said June skipped ahead half a year goodness gracious so for the month of January the theme was moon so we will see what will it be what other goodies will we have in here we're being caterwauled sushi is giving us some noises so let us see what do we have so unlike our previous boxes, the moon box, uh, well, unlike our previous, uh, like the mystery box or the advent box, the moon box and these bi-monthly boxes will not have individually wrapped things. So you will get your box and you get to open it up and check out your goodies. We're going to kind of take out some of these goodies and set them out and see what we get. We will have a diamond painting in here. We get some of our nice, lovely paper that Sushi loves but does not see. Ooh, we got all sorts of goodies in here. I'm excited to check it out. And here is our letter with spoilers. And we're gonna look, I'm not gonna look at the canvas yet. We're gonna leave that as a surprise, put the box on the floor so the cat can have the box. And let's break into our goodies. What do we have? have not been spoiled yet. I need to lift my chair up is what I need to do. There we go. Ha ha ha. Oh, we got a cat in a box. Mochi jumped in the box. Do I want to open the spoilers yet or no? We're going to open the other, some of the other stuff, see what we got, and then we're going to do it. That looks fun, whatever it is. Ooh, what is in here? Uh, and I like the fact that she's she did say, Abigail did say that she's always going to include a non-diamond painting craft of some type in this box. And I think that's what we're going to have right there. So let's look at this. I like how all the little baggies are moon themed. So here we're going to have our stickers. We've got the moon. We're going to put them up here. We've got the sun breaking apart for the moon. Moon child moon phases of the moon we have all different moon stickers i like that look at that we've got some different moon stickers all these different moon stickers those are fun sun and moon and a couple more Look at all of those stickers that you get. So that's a lot of stickers right there. So that was in this little one are all of our stickers. We're going to set this off to the side. We are going to have a baggie here, which is going to give us a cover minder. That, ooh, that's a <laughs> cat's uh, nice enamel. Or like that's not enamel. The, whatever the metal ones are called. Are those enamel? Um, the nice heavy duty metal with a really big uh magnet on it cover reminder with the phases of the moon that is beautiful and we're gonna get some caulk captivating caulk by the silvery moon let me look at that that's a silvery caulk Ooh. let's check this caulk out wow oh my goodness that is like such a pretty silvery color wow look how shiny that caulk is oh my goodness Look at that. Oh, it's so pretty. Ooh. Don't even bother asking me what it smells like because my flavor sensor is just not the greatest. That there's so much glitter in it. I love it. The glitter. Oh, I love that you can like see the uh the gl glitter in this though. That is super cool. Love the glitter. So we've got a cock there. So some caulk, cover minder. I should just put these down right here. So we've got some stickers. I should really put my stickers down. I'm making a mess of all the things. Let's 
stickers, 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 stickers. Cause that way when I wanna open the spoilers after I've opened the thingies or the spoily thingies, we have already opened these. Boop, boop, boop. I'm gonna leave that there. This, this, this. Let's look at this one. Ha 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 ha. What do we have in here? Well, we have washi tape, we know that. By looking at it, that is washi tape. But ooh, I like these washi tapes. These are some pretty colors with the moon theme. This one, oh, I like that one a lot. The black with a little bit of blue in there and the stars. Those are gonna run away on us. This one has like little alien heads, little like planets, uh, rockets, spaceships. All those, that's fun. Then we have this one right here, again, with the different rockets, spaceships, planets, but with the blue and gold. And then our last washi is a planets, space, time. It's like the earth is turned into a um, hot air balloon. That's pretty cool. And then space in a jar. Isn't that like a thing, like a space in a jar? I feel like that's a saying or like a common something or other. I don't know. It sounds, it sounds familiar. Space in a jar or something to that effect. But there's our washies. We're going to put those like that. Those are some great washies. Let's look at, ooh. I need to wait on those until I'm going to open those with that. What is this? What is black and squishy? The only thing I'm like, what could those be? Socks? Ooh, moon socks. Those are fun. I always, this time of year, I always need fun. I need some fun socks to wear because that's the only time I wear socks. Don't eat the bag. You can't eat the bag, kitten. No, we're not eating the bag. I always need socks to wear. This is literally the only time of year, year that I wear socks is this time of year. But those are fun. And they're tall enough that my ankles won't get cold. I like the little moons on them. And it looks like the moon has, are those little eyeballs in the moon? I feel like that's like eyeballs and a face in the moon. I'm saying those are eyes and that's a nose. And that's a big ol', maybe there's a mouth in there somewhere. But we've got some socks. Run away washi, run away washi. We're gonna put our washi right there. That's the hard part is getting the washi to stay. We're gonna wait on those. What, let's look at this. Let's see, this is going to be a moon tapestry. Ooh, that'll be fun. Oh, I like that. So I'm not gonna open it all the way to look at all of the goodies. We're gonna kinda see, oh, well, I lied, we are. We're gonna look at all of the contents of this. And see what comes in a moon tapestry kit. What is it? Okay, so a moon tapestry kit. This will be fun. So you have your frame and this looks like this will be what the finish looks like right there. If you can see, that'll be fun. So you get to do some uh, like macrame, is that what it's called? Bringing me back to like, uh, you know, like elementary, middle school when we used to do all the macrame and bracelets and everything. But there's our moon and I like the color of this rather than having it be this color. It's that pretty gray. So you'll do that and then you'll like, make the pattern, do the thing. Oh, and there's a little moon that hangs from the big moon. So we have a little moon that hangs from the big moon right here. Okay, that'll be fun. Okay, and it gives us all of our directions for the knots and how to tie our knots and make our knots. And I like the color. I love me some grays. So the fact that this is in a nice pretty gray makes me happy. That's a very soothing color makes my gray loving soul happy. Uh, like decor in my house, everything is in shades of gray. So that is going to be our moon kit there. What is in box number two? We're gonna open this this black box here. The kitten is playing with the, uh, she approves of these. She has decided that, ah, give me that, give me, no, mine, mine. I'm playing like kitten keep away. She's decided that these are now hers and she must have it. So this is now Sushi's. She has decided it is hers and she must have it. Okay, we have a square that wants to stand on its own. And we have a ball, moon. We have a moon, we have a moon. 
Okay. Oh, this is fun. We have a moon orb. Ooh. Oh, I like that is fun. We have a moon orb. And oh, it does it sit. Okay. It sits like this. You sit it on its little stand just like that. I should turn off the phones. Would you stop? I don't want this. This is yours. That mean I should turn off some of my lights and see what the moon orb looks like all lit up. I've got so many lights on in here. <laughs> like I said, I have all the lights. Whoop. So we can see a little bit of the glow. And I like that it's got like the differentiation in the patterns. So there is our moon orb. I'm going to turn it. And you can see like with it off and then on. I still have lights on in this room. So we're going to turn everything back on because I have all the lights to make sure everything's nice and bright for you guys. And we're gonna turn this back off. I like it, that's fun. Now I have something else that Sushi will like to play with because, you know, give me that, give me that. I have a chaos. I have a chaos right here. Right here is chaos, sheer chaos. All right, should we break into the diamond painting and see what we got? Because I don't wanna look at the drills in the cheat card for the drills and I don't want to read the spoilers until I have looked at this to know what it's going to be. So should we do it? Should we do it? Should we do it? Should we do it? I need to move some of this out of the way first so we can actually get into it. So we're going to move all the things and then we're going to go ahead and look at the diamond painting. Or do we want to peek at the diamond painting and go from there? Ooh. Decisions, decisions. We're going to move stuff and then we're going to go for it. That's what we're going to do. Okay. I've decided. We are ready to break into it. We have a cat still playing with the baggies. She has still decided that this is now her new favorite thing ever. Do you want this? Do you want this? Is this now yours? Yes. All right. Uh, I think the picture is on the bottom, but we're not gonna look at that because we are, and we're not gonna look at that because it says spoilers and I don't wanna be spoiled until we look at this. So we're gonna go ahead and pull this out. Do -do 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 -do. All right, box is empty. We don't want to see what it is. We have a toolkit, basic, boat, blue wax, and pen. Now, let's see. Do, 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 do. We want to pull these guys out. We have some drills. Ooh, we've got some APs. We've got some darks. We've got some purples. We got some colors, and now we're gonna go ahead and stand up so we can see what we's doing better. Do, 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 do. Lots of darks, but those are like blue, dark blues. That's probably some 310. Big old bag of 310, maybe another big old bag of 310. We will see what colors we have. It looks like it's gonna be a 50 by 60, and let's see what we have. Let's look at our drills first. Okay, kitten, you need to move. Come on over here with your toy. And we're gonna look at the drills first. Turn this backwards. I am gonna be totally surprised because I have not seen this image yet at all. We're even gonna keep our photo paper turned upside down so I don't see this. Because I have not even looked at it. Still upside down, I haven't seen it yet. All right, sushi lit. I know, she's like, let me stretch on the canvas, mom. She's stretching her little kitten booty. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at our colors. So we have a 152, 154, and then they kind of get out of co out of order there. We Oh, and then they go right here. And then we have a 159, 211, Two two one, and then we have two big old bags of three ten. So I was right; those big old bags were three ten. So two big bags of three ten. Then we have three one five, three one seven, three one eight, three five three. This pretty peach sushi that is not yours. She just grabbed a tea bag out of my candy tray. And just started to stroll off with it. She no, we're not no no, that is not yours. Stop. No chaos. You can't have all the things. Now 413, pretty gray. I'm putting them in order as I go because 
it's gonna bother me if I go through them out of order. 414. I love when they have those grades of order or grades, shades of gray that go in order. 415. Four five one five five zero seven six zero eight one four big old bag of that one eight one five and we have eight two three eight nine four now we're gonna roll into our next up colors oh, kitten on my back we have a nine o two this burgundy color and then a 961, or well, then I, we have three bags of 939. I'm, again, I'm trying to go in order here. We have three bags of 939, big old bags. That's going to be our primary color, looks like. Oh, it's getting down. Three bags of 939, small bag of 961. And then we have our... Nine six three, pretty pink. Three zero four one. Three three two eight. Three three four one. Three three seven one. Three six eight eight. And a three seven zero eight. And then we come over here and we have a three seven one two. Three seven two one. Three seven two two. Again, like I said, I like when the shades just kind of fade into each other. Get out of there. Again, we're going in order here. We're going in order. I insist. I must. I must. I did not organize these ahead of time. 3727. 3733. 3777. 3799. 3802. Apparently, we missed our 3834 right there and then we got our last few 3860 a 3865 and then we have our 344 a b a crystal so an 898 crystal and then we have a b 153 and then we have 3774 and 3777 so those are going to be our specials and now if i could get this kitten to stop causing chaos and knocking things over we would be good so those are going to be our colors so we have a pretty good balance we've got some darks which i would expect because it's a moon so we know there's going to be a moon in this image but then we've got some pinks plenty of pink yeah we've got our darks for the moon we've got plenty of pinks and then we've got our purple tones, our peaches, we've got some crystals, some ABs. I'm really curious to see what this image will be. So let's go ahead and go over to our image and see what this is. Let's see what we've got here. Are you guys ready? Oh my goodness, are we ready? That looks like the bottom, this looks like a top. We have a bo 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 bo. Ooh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let me take that top light off. Forgot I have to turn that one off. And the kitten nah, nobbled things and made a mess of all my stuff to give me a glare. Look at her. Oh wow. I was not expecting this. Wow. So we have this beautiful image here. It's called Moonlight Boudoir by Metivius. That is beautiful. Oh my word. That's gonna be gorgeous. I like that this one looks like, again, you're gonna have a good mix of some confetti over here, or well, some color blocking over here, some good places of some color blocking, but then you'll have spots where you get to do a little bit more variety for some multi-placing. That's gonna be fantastic. This is a round drill canvas. We have 46 colors which is going to be uh, three ABs and one crystal right down there. And 50 by 60, I like this, this is beautiful. Oh, I can 
see this one right here totally wants to be some bling right there. I'm curious to see. So of course we know we've got our sports designs up there, image there. Let's look at what our bling is right here. Oh, well, let's see where our existing bling is going to go first. So we have our crystal, which is going to be the D symbol right here. Where does this one want to be? Uh, so we have a little bit there around spots on her dress in the top of her blouse. Are you going to just like get yourself down and or are you going to come over here and cross chaos? Where else do we have something? We are no sushi. Oh my goodness. Sushi, we are not going under there. That is not, no. She's like, but I fit, I fit, I'm tiny, I fit. I have this really small shelf that's only maybe like that tall on my desk and Sushi is totally trying to climb underneath it because she thinks there is a treat or a piece of candy of like me candy under there that she put there that she wants because she's being a brat. She's being chaos, she's being total chaos. Oh my goodness, total chaos this evening. So, our D symbol, we have scattered in some... No, get, no, get down! That is not for you. No, we are not doing that. That is not for you. I will hold you. I will hold this chaos. So, right in here, these little spots of red that we see here, here, a little bit in here, a little up in there. Do we have any in her hair? I can't... No, I don't think so. But that, that's going to be this AB3777. What's your that? silly thing oh my goodness you're pure chaos and scattered around in this area that's going to be our burgundy ab there and then our actually no that's i was looking at the wrong thing that is going to be our crystal see i switched up things that's where the crystal is goodness the kitten distracted me and then we have this ab153 which i would assume is going to be in the moon so this ab153 in the moon is like this l shape which, yep, I'm seeing some right here. I'm seeing it over in here, right in here, 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 coming up into uh, this portion up in here. There's some of it all right through there, a little bit there, a little bit there. So definitely, yes, that is in the moon. That one was easy to find. So this one here, 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 a little bit in there. Now we have this color, which is going to be AB3774. This is the little like, whoops the little floompy symbols that is going to be right here that creamy symbol is there the creamy symbol is up here that little creamy splash in the moon there it's this symbol right here it's going to be a little couple drills right there and it's also this section of this star right here that's all that same symbol and then our last one is the Burgundy AB, which is going to be our pound sign or the hashtag for all you younger folk. But for us older folk, the pound sign. Uh, that symbol is going to be found. Da -da 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 Where is our symbol, 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 symbol? Oh, wait. No, that's an equal sign. I can't read. Goodness. Our equal sign is up in here. So the equal sign is going to be up here as well. So where we have the D's, the equal sign is going to be next to all of those D's right up in here and then right in here as well. So that is going to be gorgeous. Just with what is in there, that is going to look fantastic. Now let's see what extras we got to go with this beauty. My furnace is on. I'm talking. It's getting toasty. It feels fantastic. It's cold here. I don't like it. I want to go back to the warmth and be toasty warm. Let's see. Our drill suggestions. Violet Moon. Use in place of 211. Starlight. Use in place of 3865. Add these crystals randomly to her robe for extra sparkle suggested usage. Galactic Garnet. Vintage Crimson, Ruby's Darling. So we've got some extra goodies. Oh, I like these little vials. Oh my goodness, those are so cute. Oh my goodness, they're so cute. The packaging, so cute. So cute, and they have little labels on the front of them. So right here is our Violet Moon. This is gonna go in place of 211, which is going to be the predominant sig uh, symbol 
in the moon that makes the bulk of this right here of our moon. That she's recommending to replace with this beauty right here, which is a, looks like a glow, um, or not a glow, but like one of those jelly AB, violet moon jelly AB type ones. That is going to be really pretty. And then we have Starlight. I assume that's probably, yep, this one right here. So this little one right here is going to be Starlight. I'm going to turn this light on so we can see these drills here a little bit better close up. So that's our Violet Moon. This is going to be our Starlight right here. Beautiful. That Starlight is going to go in place of 3865, which I assume, yep, which would be awesome in, obviously, you guessed it, stars. So like right there, a little bit in here. And then you're also going to get some of that sparkled in these portions of the moon right here, those white spots of the moon. Uh, and I'm going to leave the big old glare right here just so you can see these other three drills. So we're going to have some extra sparkle from these crystals for her robe to be scattered in randomly for extra sparkles. So we have a galactic garnet so this beautiful garnet red which is gorgeous which you could use for either a 3802 or a 902 the 902 is going to be kind of in a, this area here this region here that's where the 902 is kind of in this portion here and here so kind of in her leg that's where we find the 902 our 3802 is going to be more of this area here, kind of these symbols, and again in this area, but a little bit of a different section. So you have choices for that one. And then we have our Vintage Crimson, which is more of a ready red. Beautiful color. Again, they're all beautiful colors. That one she recommends for 814 which is going to be our peace sign, which is all of this right in here. That's going to be a big bulk of this. It's going to be right up around in here. That is a very predominant symbol throughout. So that one will be there. And then our last one is Ruby's Darling, which is another really pretty red, which she recommends for 815 which that one is going to be M, which our M's are also going to be right up in here. We see some M's also up in her hair, but we're not going to do the hair. And we see those right through here, and we see them scattered down throughout there. But those are the drills. Let me turn that back off so we get rid of that glare. So throughout the entirety of here, we could have some beautiful scattered special drills on this gorgeous gorgeous lady she is a beauty and i think that that will be incredible oh my goodness and now let's look at our sticker sheet i didn't even look at the sticker sheet to see the original art so let us see boom so there you go there is the original art and that's what she will look like so she's in gorgeous shades of burgundy with that nice deep uh, purpley blue background right there. And there are all of your colors. Gorgeous. She's going to be fun. I like it. That is going to be fun. And it's kind of interesting to do uh, a box like this because it'll force me uh, to kind of get things that I wouldn't necessarily think of to automatically be like, oh, I'm going to get that. It, this because it's like this is a beautiful image but it's not necessarily something that I would have automatically gone for and been like that's going to be the top of my buy list so this is fun I like it and as always it is a super amazing quality I have to make sure I keep my special drill suggestions but I'm going to put these back in their box and we will go from there so I hope you guys enjoyed watching this unboxing of the big old box and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video so oh and now Mochi's gonna come over and say hello are you coming all the way over Mochi or are you gonna stop right there are you coming no she's she's like no she's like literally just inches from the video camera there you saw like a little tip of a Mochi 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 so anyways 
that is all I have for you guys for today. So I will see you guys in the next video. Have a great day, everybody. Bye. So I was so excited to open the kit and I was so distracted by the chaos who was in utter chaos mode this evening. Like there will have been so many cuts and things to get through it all because chaos was in utter chaos mode that I forgot to open all the spoilers and read off the spoilers. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. So we have here, I'm going to sit down so I can actually see what I'm doing here. Hello friend. It gives me great joy to unveil to you the first Swartz scription. Inside this box you will find a curated collection of moon items. I am always curious about why things are selected so I thought I would include a bit about each item. Inside this box you will find diamond painting, moonlight boudoir. This exclusive stunning piece was created by the wonderful Metavius specifically for this box. Five special drills. Check it. Five. Oh yes. I have them rolled up inside here so I don't lose them. This piece comes with some pretty drills, but as always, I desire more. Check out the card included in the bag with the drills for more information and placement recommendations, which means we have a total of nine drills charted now for this canvas, which will be awesome. Uh, moonlight, decorate your craft space and get inspired with this battery operated moonlight, which is super cool and super fun and I love it. Washi, we love a coordinated look. Surround and section your new piece with this stunning astrological themed washi. Captivating caulk. Congratulations, you are one of the first people to get my newest creation. I wanted to try something new for these boxes in the new year. This caulk is truly captivating. And I have got to say, I am loving the sparkly caulk. And that is awesome. Macrame Moon. We crafty folk occasionally like to dabble in new crafts. Macrame is new for me and when I saw these beautiful moons, I knew I had to include them. I am looking forward to that. That looks super fun. Moon Phases Minder. This metal minder is a perfect complement. Whoop, where is it? It's the perfect complement to the piece. And yes, it is. I love it. Moon Rock Candy. I love to include a small treat in every box. Enjoy this sweet treat whilst you, whilst you craft. I have to look. Where was it? Did I see it? Uh, it's probably in there, but the cat probably moved it. Maybe it's just in there, but... Oh, yep. There it was. But... And moon socks. Wear these socks while you craft your heart out. Thank you so much for supporting my small business. I loved putting this box together and I truly hope you enjoy it. And absolutely, I totally do. So, love it. This was a blast. So, yes, that was the moon box. And I am super excited for it. I love all the goodies. So much fun having all these goodies and now I have this nice big black bag to store things in which is super fun as well. So yes, if you have not already signed up for Swartscriptions, I highly recommend. I've already, uh, like she's closing them out uh, for each month you have to order by like two months in advance so that way you have signed up with plenty of time, I believe. I believe that's how she's doing it. And uh, I'm excited because I've already, I'm getting the February one. I'm like, why is this not working? I'm trying to do things the wrong way. That's why it's not working. So now I am for real Z, real Z going. I'm just going to do that. I'm having issues. I've got issues. You do too. We all have issues. Anyways, that's it. Bye. Bye.